They do a good job on this listing in the secondary image of showcasing motion coverage. I think that's really strong. Their third image shows install in minutes. I think that's very strong, but they don't humanize the product at all. So th that's the only two things I like about this listing. Loud motion center alarm. What I like about this image is it's showcasing like coverage, right? It's also a red color. It's very attention getting. I like this, this image here showcasing like how you could use it. I like okay. that as well. By the way, our original listing is decent, right? Yeah. But what I'm trying to figure out is like, what would we put on the cell phone image? Maybe something like this with like show show inside the home with like some red coverage Cover area because the red will pop on the search result. So you go back to the search results here. I yep. clicked on the red. I scrolled yeah, past all the white. It caught your eye. Yeah. So I want to I want to see a red coverage zone with an interior home shot with whatever you can come up with inside the home that makes sense. And on that second listing, if you're going to go for the 40 year old mom, maybe you put something like this on that main image. That is very strong and a very strong uh, lifestyle. Yes. Instantly attached to the 40 year old mom or 35 year old mom. Stay away. Oh my God. Okay. <laughs> like scare away. Like this, this image wins an award. Like, wow. Um, and look how much sales these guys have. I, I know we're a $25 product, but like that was strong. That was really strong, like hilarious. You immediately started laughing, right? So when you're trying to crack the customer avatar in a technical product like this, right? Like uh, I have no idea why this image works, but it does. Why would grandpa have this on the floor? No freaking clue, right? Is he keeping it in his pocket maybe? Maybe that's what he's doing. I don't know. I'm guessing that the product alarmed his family that he fell but but our product's probably not specialized no in no that. it's not but this image works for me right like this is as close as we've gotten so far as we're trying to discover the the customer avatar for the 65 year old male yeah. this was it the the context was not but this is the sort of thing you're looking for minus needs some eye contact with the with the the lens the designers sometimes forget to get that eye contact so i need you to make sure you're whenever you do qa you're like hey this is okay. nice but i need eye contact with okay. the camera i think i've gotten this as far as i can get you Oh, so good. my suggestion is, is is do some homework to really understand that customer avatar and nail it because that is how you're going to blow this product up. Spend significant time trying to get the main image right. The secondary images won't be as important, but keep the customer avatar theme congruent. You've got multiple SKU variations. You have the ability to set a customer avatar as the 65 year old male on one and the 40 year old female on the other. Separate them out, do a totally different set of designs and different context cues between the two listings and sell that as a strategy to the brand and be like, look, we believe we can sell your product multiple customer sets. Here's how we're going to do that. We're going to customize our customer avatar on each variation and we're going to chase different customer sets and what that does is it's going to increase your sales because 65 year old males are going to buy this like like a stash sale uh and <laughs> the 40 year old woman is going to come in and say this is going to help me protect my kids